Hello everyone, hope you're all doing okay. Um, been a while since I've made a video, but I wanted to share with you a purchase that I've made. I couldn't find anything else on YouTube about uh, what I bought, so I thought I'd make a video for other people to hopefully see and get some information from. As you can probably tell from the title, I bought some photo tiles from Free Prints and I've upgraded to the glass version, so I wanted to show you uh, basically what they're like. So, first of all, aha, this is what they look like from the side. As you can see, the glass is really, really thin. Um, much thinner than I thought, which makes it very, very light. Me and my bubble was on her first day of um, nursery. As you can see, the glass is super shiny and lovely, and you don't see the ink, so I assume it's printed on reverse. Um, on the back and then flipped over. Um, <clears throat> they came really nicely packaged with lots of cardboard in between and all wrapped up so they weren't going to break. On the back, get a nicer picture rather than my ugly mug. There we go, one of daddy when Sakura was first born. On the back, we have the warning about don't hang it above a bed. <clears throat> this is plastic, uh, like a lovely matte finish plastic, and this is like a foam, like a really dense foam. And when I first saw it I thought, oh foam really? I didn't upgrade to get foam, but it just it makes it super light, really really light. Um, so I, if you've got strong double sided tape I couldn't see how it would fall off. I've only just unboxed it as well. It's one of me and my bubbles when she first popped out. <laughs> I love it because my face just says, thank God that's over. <laughs> thank God. So that's the first three. Um, right now I'm discovering that there's kind of good things and bad things. The good thing, obviously, is that they look really good. They're super thin. I've already managed to drop one on the floor and it didn't break, so that's good. Um, but that was just me being clumsy. The bad thing, one of the bad things is they're quite expensive. Look at those big brown eyes. They are, <clears throat> you get a free tile every month. For those who don't know, I'm kind of jumping ahead of myself. For those who don't know, with free prints photo tiles, they give you a free tile every month. But that's the basic plastic tile um, <clears throat> and if you want to upgrade to plastic you need to pay four pounds so that's what I've done because I just I really wanted that shiny shiny ones there you go first picture of granddad and Sakura and granddad's on his phone and I've only just realized there's a man in the background yay <laughs> good old hindsight um, so they're quite expensive this lot um, cost me £64, which is quite expensive. That's another good thing about the foam is that you can stack these. If you wanted to put them away somewhere and swap tiles out, then you could quite easily just put them on top of each other, wrap something around them, um, tape or something, and like even piled on top of each other, they're really not that heavy. Um, so yeah, that's something really good about them. Yes, they are quite expensive. It did cost me 64, £4 for the free tile that wasn't free. Um, and then £12 for each tile after that. I've got six tiles all together. Postage was free, which is nice. Um, I think if you buy more than four tiles, you get free postage. However, there is one small problem that I've noticed. Um, oh, where's the picture? Is that the... I don't know if this is the case with the plastic as well, or if it's just the glass. They're really not very well saturated. The saturation, see here's this picture, and here is my normal free prints picture to go with it. And as you can see, the colour, the colour is just not the same. Um, and so that's something that, you know, kind of upset me really, because you know, you pay a lot of money for the tiles, you want them to look good. I don't know if that's just because the glass is tinted. No, I don't think so. Um, I don't know. I don't know why they, they will be less saturated, <clears throat> but they are. 
So yeah, I think next time I do an order, I will probably tweak my pictures and make them a bit a bit brighter, um, or rather a bit more saturated. Because yeah, obviously that's that's a thing. Um, I like getting in contact with them and just moan and say it looks different to my normal three prints picture. So yeah, that's it really. I just wanted to keep it short. I love how shiny this tiles are. They are eight inches as well, I think. Ooh, I. <laughs> they're eight inches, super light. Um, they seem really well made. I'm, I'm really happy with them, apart from the whole issue with saturation. I think they're great. Yes, they're a little bit expensive, but from now on I plan to get one each month um, to build up the collection. So that should just be four pound. No, it won't be four pounds because I'll have to pay shipping. It will probably be more like a tenner a month. But eventually I'd like to have a wall full of photo tiles upstairs on the landing. Um, so if people go upstairs to use the bathroom, they can see all the pictures and yeah, it will just be really good. That's what I'd like to do. So yeah, that's it. I hope you found this somewhat useful. Um, please give me a like if you did. Um, and if you didn't, then oh well. Bye. <laughs> um, anyway, I hope everyone's doing okay in these crazy, crazy, crazy times. And I will maybe speak to you later. Thank you for watching. Bye.